Pilates instructor in Palm Beach, Florida, and you're watching the American Fitness Network. Today, we're going to do a lesson for those of you that are lucky enough to have a reformer in your home. We're going to go over an arm series called Swaka T. It's four separate arm series, all done with a different purpose in mind. So let's begin. Okay, for Swaka T, we're going to start on our knees. So you're going to be in a kneeling position. Take your inside knee and place it right up against the shoulder rest and the outside knee just about a little wider than hip distance apart. Now, for the Swakati series, everybody's level is going to be different, so you want to start with kind of a light spring. You can always go heavier, but for me today, I'm going to start on a yellow just so I don't get too fatigued while showing you guys the exercises. So I'm going to bring it down to one yellow spring, or if you don't have color-coded springs, just one very light spring. So I'm going to take my outside arm, this being my right arm, and grab my front handle, Starting with my left arm down by my side, right arm up in line with my shoulder. My fist is lined up with my opposite shoulder. Stomach pulled in, abdominals engaged. I'm going to take my arm and bending all the way out, and then come all the way back in, land with that fist in front of the shoulder. Open up through the shoulder and the elbow, reach towards the wall, and bend it back in. Let's try three more. Extend it all the way out, big reach. Come back in, shoulder staying dropped. And again, big extension and reach. Trying to get longer with every pull. One more, big extension and reach, and come all the way home. Next one, I'm gonna switch hands. Slide my inside hand into the strap now. Stomach still tight. My other arm is reaching down my leg. I'm gonna take my inside hand and imagine that I'm shaving off my ear, reaching slow all the way up to the ceiling, sliding my other hand down my leg and then bring it back in, elbow lands right at the rib, thumb right at the shoulder. Again, reach up to the sky, slide the other arm down the leg, and pull it back down. Let's try three more. Reach it all the way up to the ceiling, and pull back down. It's okay if you wanna do a little bit of a lean with the body to help you reach that arm back up. One more time, big reach, and come all the way back down. For the third one, we're gonna go into the overhead. We're gonna take the knees and move them to the other edge of the reformer mat. Knees are still wide. I'm gonna take my inside hand and place it on the shoulder rest. I'm gonna lift my outside hand over, feeling a nice stretch all the way up the right side of my body. Gazing at the hand below me, taking the fist, we're gonna stretch it up to the ceiling and bend it back over the head. The top of my arm stays completely stabilized, no swinging in the elbow, just stretching the fist up and bending it back over the head. Let's try two more. Squeezing through the tricep, bend it back down. One more time, stretch up, squeeze through the tricep and come on back down. For the last one, we're going into the lotus. We're gonna make a W with those arms, like a little lotus flower position. Stomach is still tight. Tailbone is still dropping down towards the floor. I'm gonna raise my arms, maintaining this shape up over my head like a big Eiffel Tower and then pull back down through the lats. And again, raise those arms up and bring it back down, trying to get those fingers to touch, maintaining equal pressure and down, trying to control the carriage back in, never letting the spring take over. And one more time, all the way up and all the way down, dropping those shoulders. Place the strap back on its peg, turn around and take the whole series on the other side. So that's just a little taste of some of the exercises that we do here in my studio. Um, if you don't have a reformer at home or you've never taken a Pilates private class, I hope this motivates you to get out there, find your local Pilates studio, and maybe try um, a reformer class either as a group or as a private and see how it can change up your workout from the stuff that we've done at home to um, stuff that you can do on a reformer and how differently it'll work for your body. So for the American Fitness Network, I'm Lauren Small. Thanks so much for watching.